Good morning, or depending on when you're watching this, good afternoon, good evening, or good night. My name is Ross, and as always, told I had a voice for radio, so today we are continuing our celebration of the release of the newest expansion, Burning Shadows, by doing a little bit of an opening. We're going to be opening one of the free pack blisters from the new set. Now, there are a couple of options here. You do have Cosmog, you have Alolan Meowth. I'm uh, going to be honest, I can only find Cosmog today. So we can only do Cosmog today. But you know the deal, ladies and gentlemen. If you would like me to do an opening for Alolan Meowth, chuck a comment down. Now, we've done free pack blisters in the past. The first one I did, shall we say, slightly unsuccessful. I'm convinced that these packs have a higher rate of opening success than your average booster packs, booster boxes, etc. Unfortunately, the first video we did was somewhat unsuccessful. So now it's time to have a go at some Burning Shadows and see what we get. And the downside here is that the Cosmog promo, it, it, it's a Cosmog promo. It's just not particularly exciting, ladies and gentlemen. It's fine, but it, I mean, it, it, it's a Cosmog. You know, it's not going to break it. So, three packs of Burning Shadows. My very first packs of Burning Shadows. And hopefully... We're going to get some fun stuff. What I'm really looking for here is a Gardevoir GX and a Galissapod GX because they are the cards I am most excited about in this particular set. We have Cabrawler, a Routes, that'll help. We have an Inkay. We have a Jupiter, not Jupiter. I am convinced about that. We have a Tangela. We have a Reverse Hollow Kelia. And a Persian. That is the rare from this pack, ladies and gentlemen. Persian, not particularly great. Water Energy. Whirlypeed. Guzma's actually a very good card. Guzma's going to keep a lot of its value. Guzma is an amazing supporter card. And at the moment, it's looking like it might be worth a couple of bucks. So yay for Guzma. And Super Scoop Up. Good card, but it is a reprint, ladies and gentlemen. So it's not ever going to be ridiculously valuable. There's just too many of them out there. Now I'm only expecting one good pull from these three packs, so not getting one in the first pack has not broken my spirit. We have a Hoot Toot, we have a Sandy Gast, we have a Rhyhorn, and I can already see the outlines of a GX, I'm getting a little bit excited. We get a Marrow, a lovely little, like a crocheted Marrow. A Caterpie, a Reverse Holo Pansage, and we know there's a GX. What's it going to be? It's going to be Charizard GX. I like Charizard GX. I uploaded a video earlier today about Beware Mill. I need a Charizard GX for my Beware Mill deck, and now I have one. Yay! Uh, Grass Energy is fairly standard. Wobbuffet could be fun. And we have a Wick and a Surviper to finish off. But ladies and gentlemen... Charizard GX. Now, I know I failed in my previous opening video, but I've just pulled a GX from a free pack blister. So right now, I'm feeling a teensy bit vindicated. But I did once get two GXs in a free pack blister. I pulled a Decidueye and a Primarina. So let's see if we can get incredibly lucky. Porygon is my boy, but he's not terribly playable. We've got a Caterpie. We've got a Panpaw, an Alolan Rattata, a Mudbray, a Rev Hollow Venipede, a Slowking. We've got a Lightning Energy, a reprinted Weakness Policy, and a Heatmore and a Kelia. So to get a Routes and a couple of Kelia for my Gardevoir deck, we got a Guzma, and Guzma is a pretty good card, ladies and gentlemen, but we got... A Charizard GX. I'll take that. And the great thing about getting a Charizard GX is that people love Charizard. Charizard cards hold their value better than almost any other Pokemon. Maybe better than any other Pokemon. So having a Charizard GX, that, ladies and gentlemen, is an exceptionally good thing. Now, I do have another opening video coming tomorrow, but you know the deal. If you like these opening videos, 
chuck a comment down below. Make sure you like this video, subscribe to this channel, follow me on Twitter at the Wossy, and Twitch for some live action at twitch.tv slash PTCG Radio. If you want to support the channel, you can do so at patreon.com slash PTCG Radio. There's bonus pods and such. Go have a look. It'll be fun. But by far the most important thing as always, look after yourselves until next time. Thank you very much for watching. My name's Ross, and you've been watching PTCG Radio.